Hey folks, so I just wanted to update real quick because it got updated and now I have like stuff on there. If you go into the store, you can actually like see apps. Um, there's a bunch of games on here. And, you know, really important, I have the business streaming app, which if I launch it, it makes a loud sound, but um, you can see my computer's on. Click it, it loads, and I'm in Steam. Like, it just feels, I mean, not entirely native because it's, you know, wireless streaming, but it is like full Steam. I can just start up Pavlov and do stuff. As of right now, it seems to not pass through the microphone yet, though. Um, which I've been told is going to change in the future. The, like, audio drivers aren't ready yet or something. But, um, you know. Full on problem. And, um, see it just works but uh what i've noticed is it uses the i mean i think i can still tune the quality a bit it's a little low quality right now but um it is like using almost the full resolution which is pretty crazy and if you go into controllers it'll uh see it uses the five cosmos controller bindings so any game that supports the Cosmos will work with this thing, which is honestly most games because the Cosmos basically is just uses touch controller bindings, but um, yeah, it's just like, it works, you can throw stuff really well, or, I mean, you know, as long as you don't try and overhead, overhead it, but And, you know, just... Alright, I mean... Probably use my right eye. Not the best at shooting with right, but... You know, for recording's sake. Cool. And, um... Uh, you know, obviously climbing works too. And this is just over Wi-Fi. I have the router sitting right there, and my computer over there. Hey! And because Climby loads the controllers from Steam VR, it just shows the controllers perfectly in the game. I have noticed the uh, colors are slightly off, which I don't know. Maybe it's a color space thing or. They're trying to compensate for the compression messing up the colors a bit, or it is the compression messing up the colors, I don't know. But, um, this is like the full PC version, as you can see by the shadows, I guess. Because if you, let's see, exit VR, and then I just go to lobby. As you can see, I'm still in, you know, the headset. I can launch the native one. Native climby. And, Welcome back. you know, has the shadows, but... It also honestly runs a little nicer, because climby listens pretty narrowly about, like, on... Um, in terms of latency, but it isn't unplayable in the streaming mode. It's just a little compression-y and like everything's a little softer. And this is still in beta, so it's like not um, gonna be final, perfect. But uh, 
that's wireless streaming. It just works now. And it's just like one simple app on your computer, too. It's not like a heavy... You have to install Viveport and all that shit. No, it's just a single little app that's pretty lightweight that does all this. It's uh, crazy. I'm really impressed. I was not expecting this to be ready yet, but uh, apparently it is. Hmm? Click it? Yeah.